Today let's talk about BB-8, the little droid that stole my heart last December. BB-8 is a BB unit astromech droid that operated approximately 30 years after the Battle of Endor. And of course we saw him for the first time during The Force Awakens. BB-8 is usually never far from Poe Dameron's heels, serving alongside the man during his time as a New Republic commander and flight leader, and then following Poe when he ended up leaving the New Republic for the Resistance. Though it has self-preservation protocols that make BB-8 a bit skittish or easily frightened as we saw in The Force Awakens, its experiences have also created a very strong loyalty subprogram that cannot be overwritten. And along with its selenium power drive and its goal-focused personality, all these things come together to keep BB-8 rolling along even in the face of danger when his safety protocols might say, hey, uh, maybe we should stop doing this and run away. And this dedication is seen anytime Poe goes on a mission without BB-8 and BB-8 is left behind and all he will do is just sulk because he is so upset he can't go with his master and friend even if the mission is dangerous. Or this dedication can also be seen during The Force Awakens, when even in the face of danger, BB-8 spots the First Order's invasion on Jakku and attempts to warn Poe. When Poe realizes he won't be able to complete his mission for General Leia, he sends BB-8 alone to do so. Something the droid does bravely, evading stormtroopers and rolling into the desert night, which is a big deal for a skittish, easily frightened droid. However, despite this loyalty and goal-focused personality, it isn't uncommon to hear BB-8 either whimper or suggest retreat when there's a worrying situation. And in general, BB-8's personality is a bit unique compared to other droids. Poe would note that every droid has a, a bit of a stereotypical personality, whether that's sullen or grumpy or bossy, which fits into their program personality. But BB-8 is a bit different. He is sometimes childlike, other times a bit precocious, and other times Poe would swear that the little droid was daydreaming, which is ridiculous of course because that would mean that BB-8 had an active imagination. So on to BB-8's build, which may be the least interesting part of the video for some. Luckily, considering BB-8 was rolling around in the desert for a bit, BB-8 has a dense shell and sealed access points that prevent dust contamination that would have seized the servo motors of older models. BB-8 also has an internal orbiculate motivator that rolls its body, while its head is kept perched atop the spear with magnetic casters. Wireless telemetry between the head and body removes the need to keep the head tethered to a single contact point. When BB-8 needs extra stability or goes through areas he can't easily roll through, it fires compressed liquid cable launchers that then reel the droid into hard-to-reach spots. It also has six swappable circular tool bay discs that can be replaced and upgraded with minimal reprogramming. BB-8 converses in the 27th generation droid speak code, a compressed variant of the most common astromech language. On top of all this, BB-8 is also equipped to control the flight and power distribution systems of a starfighter when the droid is locked in its astromech socket just like the older, larger astromechs that assist the ranks of the Resistance Starfighter forces. And Poe grew up with tales of these heroic pilots and their trusty astromech droids, and because of that, he has a deep respect for the, the droid companions, and especially BB-8, and he shows this respect by always making sure that BB-8's mechanical components are kept clean and his programs up to date. And in return, BB-8 shows appreciation for his respect by making sure that any ship assigned to Poe meets his configurations and preferred settings and preferences. They're like the ultimate bromance. Everybody was all up about Poe and Finn being the ultimate bromance. BB-8 and Poe, that's where it's at. An interesting fact, before BB-8's last mission, his tracking mode, which keeps him connected to the Resistance Network, was neglectfully turned off. So that is all we know so far about BB-8, the little droid that is trying to give R2-D2 a run for his money for the cutest droid in the galaxy. Make sure you give this video a thumbs up, it helps the channel out a lot. Make sure you subscribe and come back every week for new Star Wars videos, Game of Thrones videos, comic videos, and really anything sci-fi fantasy related.
BB-8 is a BB unit astromech droid that operated approximately 30 years before the Battle of Endor. Why do I keep saying before?